and welcome back to Veggies by Eos. Today I will be showing you how to make your own acai bowl at home. So not only is this a quick and easy way to make a healthy breakfast, but obviously it's gonna be a lot cheaper to do it at home rather than going out. So your first step is obviously just get your blender cup ready. And then the fruits I'm gonna be using today is dragon fruit and then raspberries. You can really use any frozen fruit you want. I like doing dragon fruit and then something else. I usually end up doing dragon fruit and raspberries because I really like raspberries. Um, and then I add acai powder in later, which you'll see. So I don't add in um, like any actual acai berries or frozen acai or anything like that. I'm honestly not sure where to find it. Um, so I just use dragon fruit. Filled up to about there with dragon fruit. There's the raspberries. I then use apple juice. It's hard to say how much I use because I eyeball it every time because um, you don't want to use too much or the consistency will be bad, but you obviously can't use too little or it won't blend at all. Um, I, think, I think I'm gonna add a little bit more. Adding the juice is something you'll have to experiment with. Yogurt is the next thing I add. So now I just added some honey. Next I'll add some chia seeds. And I got these ones at Walmart actually. This is the next thing I add, which is the acai powder I was talking about. And this is what it looks like. And now with that, we are all ready to get blended. The thing that's different about making an acai bowl versus like a smoothie or something is you can't just put it on the blender and the whole thing blend. You're going to have to kind of tap it, shake it around a little bit, um, get the bottom part up by the top. So it does take a couple of blendings usually. And honestly, I think I might have used a little bit too much liquid this time, so it's going to be a little bit easier for me. And I think that looks pretty good. Once you're at this point, you can really add whatever toppings you want to your acai bowl. I personally always add at least some granola. This is the granola I use. Um, I really like this brand and it seems pretty healthy too if you look at the ingredients. I like to add coconut as well. At this point, you could add more chia seeds or honey if you wanted to. Since I put that in the base already, I don't see a need to, but you can. Other than that, just add fresh fruit, obviously whatever fresh fruit you like best, and there you have it. I actually don't have any fresh fruit on me right now, so I'm not gonna put any on, um, but I normally do, so I normally put that on. So thank you for watching. If you'd like to see more food videos like this, go ahead and like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Bye. Blue. Blue. Hi there. Oh, oh he's gonna stretch. I'm surprised they haven't knocked my setup over to be completely honest, but pretty glad they didn't. <laughs>